What's up guys, it's your boy Darskin, and today we're going to be talking about should Zhongli use an HP hourglass or an attack percent hourglass. Now, someone asked me this um, in my video yesterday on Zhongli, whenever I switched from energy recharge to HP, and they wanted to know uh, which one was better. Now, I assume they're only talking about the ultimate. I mean, obviously talking about, you know, auto attacks and stuff like that, but I assume they're talking about specifically the ult because the ult has HP scaling and has attack percent scaling, whereas everything else in Zhongli's kit that does damage only has attack percent scaling right now. So um, I assume they were talking about the ult mainly, and that's pretty much the showcase I gave in that video as well, so that's why I say that. Anyway, this is what Zhongli used to have on, or what I, used, I, I have on him currently for my build. Uh, HP percent, HP base, energy recharge, attack, attack. What I'm going to be testing with is this right here, which is going to be attack percent, energy recharge, crit damage, element mastery, defense. Now, it's obviously going to be a rough comparison because you can't replicate substats. But uh, yeah, we are going to be comparing these two and seeing what we can do. Now, in my uh, video yesterday, if you guys didn't see it, I have 35,000 HP and... Uh, my ult hits for about 60,000 with a crit. Now, I um, I have crit rate food on right now. It doesn't give me any damage boost, but it gives me crit rate. Uh, and we're going to ult and see if we can hit a crit. Um, with Zhongli, see what the damage is going to be. Now, um, I already know the answer to this question. This is mainly just to show you guys or anyone else that may have this question the answer. Uh, cause I know a lot of you guys probably want to know what you should be running on your Zhongli's. I'm going to group them up so I can, uh, hit all of them because I've tried to, I've tried to do this with, um, I've tried to do this with hitting, um, one of them. As you can see, I hit for 71,000, right? So, you look at 71,000 and you compare it to my 60,000 with HP, you're doing a lot more damage on your ult with the attack percent. So, uh, anyone wanting to know, the answer is yes, attack percent is better um, according to the ult. Now, the question is, will that be the same answer when um the buffs come out for Zhongli and the answer is probably going to be no and the reason why I say that is because when the buffs come out for Zhongli his auto attacks will have HP scaling right his you know this drop will have HP scaling and his uh hold E will have HP scaling now it it, it very much depend it, it's very subjective depending on how you are using Zhongli if you're using Zhongli as your main DPS or main damage unit, which I am, right? I'm using Zhongli as my main damage unit. Um, even though he's not a main DPS, I can, you can still use him as an ult spam or main damage unit or whatever, right? Um, if that is the case, then yes, going attack percent is better. Now, if you're using Zhongli as a supportive type of unit, then going HP is going to be better because the shield is going to be stronger, um, and you'll still be getting damage on your um, auto attacks and everything like that. Now, for the majority of people, y'all are probably using Zhongli as a supportive type of unit. Sub DPS, whatever the case may be. If that is the case, you want to go HP. Now, if you're using him in the forefront or as your main DPS type of unit, like I am, right? I'm using I'm using Zhongli in the, in, in the front, like this. You know, auto attacks, you know, pop his ult, stuff like that. Um... Attack percent is going to be better. Now, obviously, it's up to you because this is a thing, right? I use him up front as a main DPS type of unit, but I still use HP. Now, I know a lot of you guys are going to be like, well, DS, why, why do you use HP when attack is going to do more damage? This is the thing, right? My team, number one, is built around supports, I guess you could say. Everyone being a support. Um, and even though they're all supports, they all still do damage. They all combine and do a different stuff like that, right? So Zhang Li, I'm not using him only for his ult damage. If you are, or if you're only using him for his damage, then you want to go attack percent. I'm using Zhang Li for his entire kit, which would be the ult damage, the E damage, the E hold damage, auto attacks, the shield, everything, right? On top of, um, 
you know, his ult damage. So that's why I run him HP. And I just like having him with a lot of HP. So his shield's pretty good. Or really good, anyways, at 35,000. You look at my unit, um, Albedo. You know, and, and this is just an example. Albedo, I'm running him um, crit damage, crit rate, def uh, defense right there. This is energy recharge, crit, uh, crit damage, defense. Defense main stat, energy recharge, attack percent, crit rate, crit damage. Geo damage, defense right there. Crit rate, crit damage. So my um, Albedo, he has some of everything, right? He has a whole bunch of defense for his E. He has some attack, some crit damage for his... Uh, well, crit damage goes into his E2. But attack and crit damage in for his ultimate. Uh, his attack base stat is not that high, but that's because he's using a three-star weapon, number one. And then um, I don't really have any attack percent rolls. My rolls have gone into defense because I'm using his E a lot more than his ultimate. But I still have a lot of crit rate from the weapon, right? It's not actually going to be this high if that weapon's not procking. Um, really good crit damage. Uh, some geo damage. So I got him with a mix of everything. You look at Beto, right? I'm running Beto, two piece electro, two piece physical. Even though she has a uh, electro cup, she can do auto attack damage. She can do, you know, all of these things. So to answer anyone's question, if you're running him specifically for damage, attack percent um, is the answer. And if you are running him for a supportive type of unit or build, then HP is the answer. So. Anyway, there you guys go. Uh, my cat is wanting my attention. But anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Be sure to give a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.